Hi everyone, Lee Magpie here and today I'm going to do my plush versions of the Tum Tums collection. Um, a few months ago I did the um, show and tell of the plastic um, figure versions of these um, Zum Zums and now I'm going to show you the plush versions. Um, I've been collecting them for a while, I love them, I know they aren't as pop um, popular as they used to be but I actually display mine in the Disney Animator collection box. It's a very big box. I want to get rid of the box and for good reason why I didn't want to get rid of the box is because it looks perfect for display purposes. This is where I'm going to display all my Zum Zums in there, stack them on top of each other and I just think it's perfect for display purpose. Um, it closes like that so you can actually close the box and that's why I didn't want to get rid of the Disney Animator Dolls Collection box. So I can display my plush Zum Zums inside. And without further ado guys, I'm going to get down to showing you my Zum Zum plush collection. So these are all my Zum Zums. I'm going to carry on collecting them. I know some places, I think they stopped selling them now. Um, some of these I got even from Toys R Us. Rest in peace Toys R Us. Um, which is really sad and some of them I got from Clinton's, some of them I got from um, eBay and some of them I got from the Disney Star but without further ado I'm going to show you my Zoom collection and this is, I'm still collecting them, I'm just struggling to find some and I'm going to start off with my Bugs Life ones and my first one is um, the Caterpillar from Bugs Life. I can't pronounce his name. I have pronounced his name before. Um, I know it comes with H. Um, his name's on his tag there. I got him from the Disney Star. Um, and he's really cute. He's got this really cute um, face. He's got a um, light green face with orange circle cheeks. Um, he's got leaf green body. Um, red antennas and then he's got some um, like little spikes on the back on his back and they're made out of felt and then he's got loads of little legs and he's got some nice bit of embroidery detailing down his side and I just think overall he looks really really cute so that's the caterpillar I still need to get um, the butterfly when he turns into a beautiful butterfly so that's the caterpillar from Bugs Life then I've got Dot, she looks really nice as well, she's got some little freckles here, she's in this really light purple, she's got these little cute wings, she's got this really cute face, she's got a bit of eyelash um, embroidery detail there and she's really nice and she feels soft, um, she's my favourite character in the film. Um, I ain't seen Bugs Life for such a long time, but she's my favourite and her um, antennas are real nice and soft as well. So that's Dot. And then we've got Flick. He's really nice in this sky blue colour. He's got a nice bit of embroidery on his back. He's got a nice face and he's also really soft. And I got him from the Disney Star as well. Um, oh no, actually I got him from Toys R Us. Um... And I like his cute face. So that's my collection for the Bugs Life. I still need to get the Caterpillar. And I think there's one more I would like to get. So I'm just going to place these down there. Next I've got the little three peas in a pod from um, Toy Story. They are so cute. Um, I actually saw these actually as a pencil case the other day. And I just think they're absolutely cute and adorable. They're in this really nice green colour. And then they've got a different green for the face. Little pink um, rosy cheeks. And I had to pick these up. And I think I got these actually for 75p from um, a shop in the UK. Um, so they're the three peas in a pod from Toy Story. And they just look so cute and adorable. Um, then I have got the coconut from Moana, which I'm going to get another coconut I've seen. And these are from the entertainment shop. Um, these come with a longer tag. I don't know what that actually means. Um, 
but I know that I'm going to get the other coconut and he's got like this red tuff here on the top of his head and then he's just got like he ain't got a proper face it's more like he's got a real small eye a big eye it's got like a light brown face in the middle and then his full body is made out of dark brown and he's got these tiny little red feet and there that's the coconut from Moana and I'm going to get some more of the coconut ones and then I've got Donald and Daffy here these two uh, make such a cute little pair Um, I am going to get the other um Daffy um, yeah the other Daffy duck as she I think is she called Don, um, Daffy or Daisy I don't know but either way I'm going to get the other one because I feel like her face is a lot wider to Donald's face but she has this pink little bow in her hair she's still got these cute this cute little face she's got nice little eyelashes nice little yellow beak and then she's wearing light um purple with light pink polka dots on her top she's got this lovely fluffy little tail yellow little feet and then um a light purple underbelly and then donald has this blue little hat what he's famous for wearing little red um dicky bow tie blue underbelly he feels really soft and he's really cute he's got this little tuff of hair there and then um, light blue puck and white polka dot top and then he's got these tiny little yellow feet and I just think that these two make such a cute little pair together and I am, I am going to get the other version of Donald, um, that Daisy sorry and yeah so that's these two um, I have got um, Mickey and Minnie here they're now these are so cute. I, I found it so tricky to find Minnie Mouse, but I finally found it. I found finally found her in the Disney store. She has this little polka dot um red skirt on, the red top, what she, what the what she's famous for wearing, and the red little um white polka dot bow in the middle of her head, and then she's got these lovely black ears, what are really soft. These little pink cheeks and then she's got this really cute face with her little eyes and then she's got a little black tail and then she's got this red underneath her belly and I just think she looks really nice she was really really tricky to find I finally found her in a Disney store out of my out of my town and then here we've got Mickey Mouse he was quite easy to find. I found him in Clinton's and he's wearing white polka dots with red top. Um, he's got the black tail. I won't mind trying to get the other versions of these. Um, there's the tag there and then there's the other tag. And then this one was five, oh no, three pounds, but in America it's five dollars. Um, but yeah, he's really cute. It's really hard to get one where they've got the perfect embroidery because they all look a little bit different um, if you actually compare them together. Um, but yeah, that's Mickey and Minnie. And here I have my Bambi, Bambi ones and I've got Farleen here. And she's got these really nice um, light blue eyes, this really nice button nose. Um, black nose she's so cute I love the embroidery on her back in these cream colours she's in this really nice brown and I just think she looks really nice with this dark brown on the tip of her ears and I just love her eyes the way they just stand out against the background with the brown and then here we've got little Bambi and she also looks really cute She's got the um, tips on the end of her ears and then she's a little bit different and she has one brown stripe down her back. She has a faded one down her back but it's more clearer here. And then she's got this little tuff here and she just looks so cute and adorable. And then on the back she's got a little yellow butterfly. So that's Bambi. So I've got flower here and she's got a little yellow embroidered flower there with a little bit of green leaf there. She's also got really nice blue eyes, but they're a little bit different to them ones. These ones are a little bit um, brighter. She's got this little tuff of hair. 
grey around the eyes, really nice black um, fair coat, and then she's got this black and white fluffy tail which looks look really cute. Um, so that's flower, she's got this really cute black nose. And then I found my other two, which is we've got Fump here and Miss Bunny here. And Fump has got this really cheeky, um, like squinty eye face. He's got this white fluffy tail and he's got this really nice grey coat with this really light cream yellow colour around his face. And he is absolutely so cute. I love his face expression and his little pink nose. And he's got these really flopsy ears. And then we've got Miss Bunny. And she's really nice. She's pretty much the same, but she has her eyes open. And she has these cute little eyelashes. Um, these pink little cheeks and this pink little nose. Um, fluffy tail. And she's in like a really faded, almost pale pink like nudie colour and then underneath she's got like a yellow little yellow belly which matches her face and she's just absolutely cute, so cute and these are a really cute pair um, and they're my favourite ones in the film as well and I got all four of these from Clinton's and Clinton's if you don't know what Clinton's is, Clinton's is a big card um, shop what sells like calendars it has a few gifts there and it's just perfect for birthdays christmas valentine's day they sell loads of um tum um zum zums and they sell loads of different um little gifts they've got really cute money boxes in the shape of zum zums and it's just a really cute shop to go shopping next i have the beauty and the beast ones this is just some of them um, I haven't got Belle or the Beast as I'm trying to stay away from the human, um, human ones and I know Beast isn't a human, well he is but he's trapped inside Beast's body but I'm trying to stay away from collecting human ones and I know these ones are animal related ones but I just couldn't resist. So here I've got Cog, um, Cogsworth and he's really nice, he's actually one of my favourite characters in the full movie. Um, he's got one of them really angry faces and I like his um, hands of the clock there. Really nice embroidery at the top. He's got like a bit of detailing of the shape of him. And I think it's really clever the way they've put the... Um, I forgot what that's called. Like the tick bit of the clock on his belly. And it's not soft either. It's in um, like... It's like printed on on his belly and I just think he looks really nice. He's got one of them scrunched up faces and that's Cogsworth. And then I've got Mrs. Potts here and she's really nice. I love the um, way the, the sewn hair and made hair into a zum zum. She's got a really nice yellow um, handle and then on the top she's got the, the top of the teapot in this purple nice little bit of um embroidered detail and then it's got like a little bit on a little pink handle and then yellow detailing around the top of the teapot and then she's got this long snout she's got these really nice eyelashes and a little bit of um pink cheeks and she just really looks really nice and she's going to spill the tea um and then here we have Lamar. I can't pronounce his name that well, but we have the candle. He's really nice. He's got these really nice candle hands in this um, felt. It's got um, the flame, the flame of the top of the candle there, and then he's just got this really cute face expression where his eyes look a little bit closed. I love his French accent in the film and the famous scene where they sat at the table. Um, and they sing Be Our Guest song. And he's really nice. He's really soft as well. And he's in this really nice yellow. And then to finish it off, we have Little Chip. And he's really cute. He's got a really cute little handle as well. And he's just got this cute face. 
Um, he don't really look like a cup. He needs to be a bit more squished and a bit more smaller. But yeah, uh, uh, other than that, they look really cute. I couldn't resist. They've even added the little chip there in a little bit of grey embroidery. And then underneath, he's got the purple to match with Mrs. Potts, the top of her head. So that's a little chip. He's really cute. I love the way his smile has around the um, handle of his nose. And then he's got these la little black eyes. So, yeah, that's the Beauty and the Beast um, ones. I am maybe going to get the Beast now that I've said what I've said. Um, but, yeah, they're really cute. And I got these from the Disney store as well. And here I have the Lady and the Tramp ones. I think I'm either like one or two away from the full collection of the Lady and the Tramp ones. But we'll start off with Jock. And he's really cute. He's got this red um, collar. He's really funny in the uh, movie. He's got this really nice stone grey, um, a bit darker grey um, coat. He looks like he's got a little moustache in this light grey. He's got a really nice face expression. And the embroidery is really nice and detailed got these eyebrows what are embroidered to match his moustache um, and overall I just think he looks really nice I couldn't resist getting Lady in the Tramp because that's one of my other favourites of Disney um, films so that's Jock and then I've got Tramp here he's got a really funny um, face expression I don't know if it was meant to be like that but obviously I had to pick him up because he goes with Lady um, but he's just in this lighter grey and he doesn't have a collar because in the movie, if you don't already know, he is a stray dog. But he finally finds his little lady and then, yeah, I don't want to spoil too much because if you haven't seen it and if you haven't seen it, you'll really enjoy it. Especially if you love Disney films. Um, so yeah, that's Tramp and he has these, like, his ears flop down a bit. And then we'll do the um we'll do the Siamese cats. I am Siamese if you please. Wow. Um this Siamese one has got blue eyes. Or like most Siamese cats do. Um it's got this really nice cream fur, the really mischievous in the movie. Um and there ain't really much I can say other than it's just got this um very what can I say, creepyish face, but they've still got like this cute fat tail, got this brown tail, and this is one of the Siamese cats, and then it has another cheeky chappy in, from the film, and it's exactly the same, but they have these squintish eyes, um, getting ready to cause some mischief in the movie, and they have one of the most famous songs from the movie, and... So that's the Siamese cats from Lady and the Tramp. And I got them from the Disney Star too with these two. So I've got the white dog from Lady and the Tramp. Um, she sings a really jazzy song in the movie. I can't remember her name, but I know that she sings um, a really jazzy song um, in the dog pound kind of place when Lady gets captured. Um, she's got this really nice soft fur. She's got a really nice mane with fluffy ears. She's got really cute blue eyes. She's got such an adorable face. And she was actually my first one I picked up from the Lady in the Tramp collection. Um, she's got this really nice fluffy tail. And she's in this cream colour. And I just think overall she's just so cute and adorable. Um, so yeah. And then I've got the... The main attraction, and this is Lady. Now, there is another version of Lady, but I like this version better because I like the way they've added the fluffy ears. And the other version, I've got more like a this kind of fur on the ears, and but this adds a bit more detail to them. So, she's got these really cute fluffy ears, and um, this really cute face expression. She's got really long eyelashes cream down the centre of her nose and she has a blue collar what she gets given by her owners 
and she's just such a cute character in the film and I just love her ears and I just think she's adorable. So these are the Lady and the Tramp um, plushies and I also got them from the Disney Star. I didn't get Lady from the Disney Star, I got Lady from Clinton's but now I'm going to do the Anister Cat. Now, I don't know if I've got all of these, and I can't remember all the names either. Um, surprise, surprise. When you watch that many Disney films, it's hard to keep up with all the names. But, yeah, I've got... Let me read it. I've got... Scat Cat. So, he's got a little brown hat on, a red bow tie, and he's in this like grey colour and he's got the trumpet on the side embroidered there in this gold embroidery which is done sewn really well um and obviously this film's all about music and it's real jazzy so that's the scat cat and it is really nice got a really cute face this one's called um Thomas uh, Miller, I think that's how you pronounce it. Um, he's got this white, like, collar. Um, he's got a green dicky bow tie, and he's got a cute face as well. Um, he's got a bit of a, a bit of a wonky face. That's just how it's been stuffed. And he's in this really nice orange collar, and then he's got a bit of orange look around there, and he's really nice. Now we've got the um, grey cat. Now I forgot his name as well. I only know I like Marie and this one's Marie. And then we've got the older lady cat as well. I forgot her name so let me know in the comments section down below. As I've took the tags off which I shouldn't have but I did. Um, they're easy to find again anyway. Um, so yeah he's got a really nice red dicky bow tie. Um, he's got like these blue eyes but they've got like a tint of they're like almost like um a tealy colour and he's just in this nice grey and he's got a red collar on and he's got such adorable face and he matches Marie really well. So and here's Marie. She's got this really nice she's got these really nice blue eyes. They're all more also almost like um a navy blue like a royal blue. She's got this really cute pink bow in her hair and she's got this tuff of um, hair on the top of her head. Really cute ears, nice little whiskers, pink little cheeks. And she's got a pink collar on, a little white tail and she feels really soft and she's like a really nice snow white colour. And then we've got the other cat and she's really nice. She's similar to Marie, I think that's the mum. I'm not entirely sure, so comment down below. And she's also got like these navy blue eyes as well. And this like yellow colour, which I think it's meant to be gold in the film. With white studs around it, um, embroidered. And then she's also got this really nice snow white fur. Really nice pink and long um, whiskers with long eyelashes and she just looks absolutely adorable. I feel like the full collection just looks so good. Now I don't know if I have got the full collection. Oh wait there, there's one more here. Um, I've took this one off as well. But he's got a um, blue bow with the same colour eyes and he's in like, he's like a ginger cat. So he's got like this orangey fur. Um, and he's really adorable as well. And he also suits Marie. Um, I haven't watched the film in such a long time. But when I watch it, I remember the characters like, oh my god, I absolutely love this film. And just to finish it off, he's got the um, a blue collar on as well. So this is the Anister Cats collection. I think I've collected them all, I'm not sure. But I got all them as well from the disney store but that is it for my zum zum collection i am going to get some more i don't think i'm going to do a part two i might do a you ask to do a part two in the comment section um they are quite hard to find now as 
the popularity has gone down a little bit. But if you're looking this this star, or if you're looking the Clinton shop or even the um, toy shop entertainer i'm sure you can still find them around and if not ebay have got them spread out um from quite expensive to ex um to really cheap um so still don't give up on them they're still they're still going strong in my eyes because i won't stop collecting them until i filled up the box um for display purpose so yeah, I am done with this video, this show and tell, this review. Um, if you liked this video, give it a thumbs up. Like and subscribe to my channel. Hope you still collect them. Hope you still find yours. And um, so yeah, for more toy related stuff, more show and tellers. Um, and I do like a mixture of toys. As you, If you don't know by now, I do stuff from like Jurassic Wells to zum zums to pokemon so give this video a thumbs up like subscribe hit that alarm bell and i will see you on the next video guys i have got some harry potter stuff coming up and i've got more Jurassic world stuff coming up so if you like that remember what to do like and subscribe and get collecting guys and i'll see you on the next one bye